Today's team holds very near to my heart. Aloha, everyone. Welcome back to another video. This is the tallest team. I like to believe if I ever made the league, I'd be the tallest kicker. It is what it is. Now, this is a lot better than the shortest squad, but it's still not incredible. Height is a really, really good indicator for some positions, but for others, it means literally nothing. For example, I've noticed that tackles are some of the tallest players in the NFL, but it's not the same for guards. Like there's some very good six foot two ish guards, but all the tackles are six foot five or taller. Tight ends are huge. Wide receivers tend to be huge. Oh my gosh. Quarterbacks tend to be really tall. It's not common that you get the Kyler Murrays and the Drew Breeses of the world, but it happens. Halfbacks can literally be anywhere from like five foot eight to six foot six. Fullbacks are kind of the opposite. You'll notice a lot of fullbacks are six three and under. So let's take a look at offense. Fun fact, the tallest NFL player ever was a D tackle, Richard Sly. Some research I did said he's seven foot two. The rest said he's seven foot tall, exactly. It's kind of like that NBA theory. Have you ever seen the NBA theory about Kevin Durant's height? Kevin Durant lists himself as six foot nine, but he's like clearly at least seven foot. I don't know. Maybe that's the same thing Richard Sly. Villanueva, six foot nine. Trent Williams is six foot five. Jonathan Ogden is the same height as Ed Two Tall Jones, which is interesting because he's called Ed Two Tall Jones. But lots of players are the same height. I don't know. Jimmy Graham, six foot seven. Mike Evans, no big surprise here. Dude's a stud, six foot five. He's basically got the Megatron build, except Megatron is faster. Talking in real life and in the game. Number 81, Megatron, six foot 236 99 speed that's a horrifying wide receiver and then alan lazard i love this guy i literally talk about this every single time but i bet two dollars last year on alan lazard to have 100 yards a touchdown and the packers to win and this was the only game the whole season that alan lazard went off and i made like 400 bucks on a dollar bet talk about that every time and that's why i'm sponsored by DraftKings. <laughs> this video is not sponsored by DraftKings. i was just saying that i need to not do that i sell out too much to be talking like that. Derek Henry! Woo! Hey, my mom is FaceTiming me. It's 2 p.m. here in Hawaii, which means it's 8 p.m. for my mom. Mama, hi. I, uh, how are you? Oh, hey, how's it going? I'm in the middle of a video. You want to say hi? Oh, it's amazing. You want to see the view? I'm about to, I'm doing surf lessons in a second here. You're going to go take a lesson? I'm taking a lesson right now. Yeah, then I'll probably buy a surfboard. Yeah, I won't get bitten by a shark. There's so many people out there, you know, they'll bite someone else. All right, cool. Well, I love you guys. I'm actually in the middle of a video, so I gotta go. Say hi to the video. Okay. Hello. Hello to Hawaii. I love you. I'll talk to you later. Well, in three days, we'll call you and we'll do an opening of your gifts that are at our house. My gifts? Oh, it's my birthday in three days. I forgot about that. Herbie, Justin Herbie. He's so tall, bro. Six foot six. We got Escape Artist inside Deadeye. And what's that last ability? And Gunslinger. I love it. Tough Nut. <laughs> Increased block resistance points. Love it. Deep in Elite, Deep Out Elite on Lizard. Deep Out Elite on Megatron. All right. Yo, by the way, if you recognize this account, this is Justin. Again, he's built some teams for me in the past. Justin, actually, I love you so much. I actually played him in the, the fattest lineup, the heaviest lineup. I played against him by pure chance. He messaged me. He's like, yo, were you just recording a heavier squad? So not only did I play him in one, but I'm also using his account for tallest. You're a stud. Thanks so much again. Defense, we got Anthony Nelson, who's six foot seven. Gronk, middle linebacker, six foot six. Tremaine Edmonds, six foot five, also 99. Gold, love that. Hendricks is six foot seven. Carl Banks, Asamuga, six foot three. See, that's like, that feels short, but corners are just not that tall. Mike Evans, out of position corner. Makes sense. This is the only like really Really oh, trash. All right, Chris Westry, are we able to view you? Or are you gonna kick me out again? I just, I guess I can't look at this guy. Chris Westry, the silver 67 corner is six foot four. The average height of an NFL cornerback is six foot one. Oh no, the average NFL cornerback is five foot 11, 193 pounds. The average wide receiver is six foot one, 210 pounds. Don't give up on your dreams, boys. You don't have to be six foot tall to be in the M N NBA. The NBA, Matt. The NBA. What are you? What? The NFL. The NFL. And then rounding out the defense, Calais Campbell at six foot seven. Julius Peppers at six foot eight, I believe. And then Marcus Hunt and DeForest Buckner. We're good to go. And I'm actually going to do the on the clock game mode. So just in case we play like a super sweater, I can always hop into another game. I love when they have house rules in, dude. House rules makes it so much fun. Top three, Lazard, Asamuga, Jessa Herbert. We're going up against Miles Garrett, Nick Chubb, and Jamal Adams. 
Tall boys, let's get it. These unis are sick. Wait, are these falcons? He's gonna throw a variation of peaks. Oh, bubble, no! Oh, I missed with middle linebacker, Gronk. Dude, I love these unis. These unis are sick. My goal is a pick six with Gronk. Ooh. He's gonna go with the handoff and get swamped by my six foot seven Nelson. I really don't know who that dude is, but come on, throw the bubble. Throw the bubble. Oh no. What's he running? What's he running? Come on, Gronk. Get there! Ooh, that's a reminder to post a banger of a video. Don't mind if I do. Come on, I have to get an interception with middle linebacker Gronk. He's nowhere near as good as he was last year. Last year he had a limited like 95 overall, but we're looking at a fourth and eight? Fourth and 12, whoa. All right, he needs something deep. He's beaming it up. Carl Banks got him. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he got touched. Yo, if we're going to use the tall squad, we have to get a fade route touchdown. That is probably the most consistent thing in the NFL that is not consistent in Madden. And I'll be honest, I talk a lot of shit about Madden, but I do love Madden. I have so much fun playing Madden 20 and Madden 21. I get pissed sometimes, but it's really fun. The only thing that I hate is that fade routes are useless. Dude, you'll have like a five foot 11 corner on six five Mike Evans and Mike Evans will get mossed. Like what? That's not how that works. Oh, oh, but Mike Evans just might have dusted him. It's not the fastest squad, but we're gonna use it like it. Mike Evans, Justin Herbert connects. Oh my God, fake PAT, Holder Blast, let's go. I love that his three letter abbreviation is rest in peace and he's about to rage quit. Holder Blast with Herbert? Oh, it is. Oh, where are you going, bro? Oh, wait, that was so weird. Lefty kickers throw me off so bad. Second and 13, this is looking like a clean sweep. This game's about to be ogre. What are you doing? Libby boxed you, put you in the blender. You're literally free. You literally have zero IQ. How do you get boxed? You're literally dog water. You're literally right. Okay, okay. Nick Chubb, going down easy. <laughs> Woo! Asamuga just did the glitch loop blitz by himself. Wait, that was insane. Play that back, bro. It's fourth and 21 and he's going for it. He does not care. God, this game is over. It's now fourth and 26. Tall squad going ham right now. Gronk, we gotta get that interception, buddy. Ah, he won't, but Asamuga will. This is an actual massacre. Oh, and if you notice, my backup tight end is Zach Gentry. Do you recognize that name? He's a 63 overall silver. He doesn't get a lot of playing time. But last year in Madden 20, someone gave him a golden ticket because he's one of the tallest tight ends in the game. And that's the only reason they gave him a golden ticket. So Zach Gentry right there, 81, I think. Yeah, 81. Let's see if we can hit him. He's not there, but X, Alan Lazard, is wide open. Herbert has thrown for 100 yards on my two completions. The only problem I have with house rules is it simulates your stats, so they're all wrong. Uh, let's throw the big one. Go uh, ahead. Have a great time. That's why I want Mike Evans to get in his body and they can fight over the ball, not just run past him, bro. Like, where are you going, Lazard? Play action? Gotta be. Dude, you cannot be running play action. <laughs> Asamuga has two sacks. Ah, I'm on the Forrest Buckner. Okay, oh. it doesn't, he did not. <laughs> what? I'm gonna get Asamuga so many sacks that it just shouldn't be allowed. Let's go, play action. Oh, it's not. Play action, no, dude, I'm gonna get Westry. The 67 overall corner, I'm gonna get him an interception. Oh, darn it. I literally wanna get an interception with Westry so bad. I'm hoping he'll throw high on the left side. We're gonna get it right here. I'm gonna bait it out of him. Yup, throw it up left. Damn it. Ah, ah, somebody get to him. Ooh, it's a big down right here, ladies and gentlemen. Where's Westry? Oh no, this is Asamuga. Oh, uh, we knew he's going there and he didn't even get it. Oh my goodness. All right, jump ball Alizard or jump ball Megatron. Um. What? What? <laughs> Bro, imagine that was a game winner. Imagine that was to end the game. Giannis, down the seam. What did I just watch? All right, let's try that again. Huh? All right, good. I'm actually on him. Let's go up. What a fucking bitch. He doesn't even animate to go up for the ball. Yeah. Alan Lazard is giving up the same way that Rodgers is. He doesn't want to play for that team. All right, the Asamuga Super Heater Blitz right here, baby. It's not Sammy, but I'm coming in anyway. What if we get a sack with Westry? You guys have to call me Godfather. 
Throws a quick out of bounds strike that doesn't complete. And we're looking at third and 15 here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Simmons is just going to go over top here. It's fourth and 25. He kind of has to go deep. Mike Evans, bro. I'm rifling this to you. You got to go up and get it. Go up, Mike Evans. Go up, buddy. All right, you know what? He went up. That's all I could ask at this point. I'm going to keep going for jump balls. All right, Jimmy Graham, it's your turn to just go up and moss somebody. Yup, yup, yup. Go up, buddy. Go up! Ah! What? Oh my god, he had it! Isn't that a catchy animation? Wait, I don't know what happened. Let's try Lizard again. Maybe I'm not believing. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Herbert's moving. Herbert's kind of moving. Get through him. Ooh. All right, Jimmy Graham, back of the end zone. He might not have to aggro catch this. He probably could just possession catch it. Oh no. We're contested. What are we gonna do here, boys? Throw it to him, aggro it! Oh, shit. Shit. I'm trying to do too much. I have all these easy routes to throw, and I'm not throwing them. Whatever. I like the way I'm playing. I'm not just taking my easy blowout W. All right, first and 10. Let's just get the ball back down. It shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, it should be my ball. This man's going up for the ball better than I am. Let's give it a go. Let's get it to underneath! Ugh, Ted Hendricks. Mine. <laughs> All right, nice. Watkins has got it. Jump ball. We're getting a jump ball touchdown before I leave here today. All right, Jimmy Graham, back in the end zone, baby. Um, he's too open for this to be a jump ball. All right, Lizard, I see you, buddy. We're getting it here. I see you. I see you. I see you. Oh! <laughs> what the fuck? He's not even going up contested, but somehow that was a touchdown. What? I don't know. I literally, I literally couldn't tell you what just happened, but I'll take it. This has been the tall squad. I don't know if I can say it performed as it should have or if it didn't. That was a weird game, but it worked out. We got a dub, technically a rage quit. I will take it. Boys, that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.